Okay, here we go. It is January 14th, 2019. We're looking at our objective for today. I can explain various ways humans use natural resources and impact Earth systems. I can explain which type of natural resources humans depend on the most for energy. So one of the things we're going to be doing today is actually creating an infographic. So I wanted to give a couple examples of what infographics are real quick. I'm going to take a look at a few examples here on the screen. That's why I'm not live in the vlog. Okay, a common one you might see, especially this time of year, is something like this. It's a cog. It's got words on it. You can see it as a picture. Ten days to better productivity. Day one. Day two. So it's talking about stop multitasking, get some sleep, have a snack. And it actually goes around through the ten days. So you follow that way. Instead of this being a list or a listicle, as they sometimes call them now, this one is showing it in picture form. So because it's a picture, it's an infographic. Um, second thing that we could be looking at right here these are just different kinds of social media tools um, same thing showing pictures with words so information to kind of support it uh, one more just kind of talking about the food industry shocking facts about the food industry this one's a little more uh, just straightforward facts but you can see there's still pictures in here to kind of give you more key details um, this one's talking specifically about corn industry and what kind of corn is going into things looking at percentages and money, so it's kind of a mixed info. Uh, most common place that you guys have probably seen infographics is with toys. So once this screen comes up, best-selling toys on eBay. This is looking at specifically over a period of time. Peak sales are in December. Um, most of them are coming from China, even if they are American toys. You can see in here there's actually pictures of the different kinds of toys as well. Barbie dollies, Hot Wheel cars, Lego... Um, actually showing specifics and then because it's about toys they have a Rubik's Cube here to kind of represent that it is about toys. Finally on those toys individually sometimes you see something like this. This is the Hello Barbie doll and the descriptions of her. There's a picture of Barbie so the doll would actually look like and then this actually describes things. Here's her microphone. You push the thing here and you get sound. Hold down her belt to activate speech recognition. So it actually draws lines to tell you information about the doll and how it works. And then there's a few other things over here about apps, specific charging stands. So this is an infographic as well. So for today, we're going to be creating our infographic about a specific item. I'm going to show you that right here. Okay, and it is not Mrs. Neewam and I and the bronze fawns. We're looking at a pencil. This is a basic wooden pencil. Got it. Wrigley Field. Bought a scorecard. You can see... Uh, it's wood, it is painted, it is sharpened on the end. So we're looking at this pencil. I'm going to try to hold it kind of in the center like this. This pencil, so I can pause it right there over my face. And you guys can kind of use that as a uh, draw a picture of a pencil on your page. We're going to start to make an infographic about what natural resources go into this pencil. So for the bell ringer, consider what natural resources you think go in there. And then we will discuss it in depth.